thing that happened earlier this week was that, that your name is on the lawsuit as a plaintiff against the university. I was wondering, um, given the context of how you, you give a lot of importance to what your dad would have felt, what your dad would have done about things in this book, what do you think your dad would think about your lawsuit against Penn State? Well, I think what I would tell you is, and again, what he would say, you know, he would be supportive because of the fact that the lawsuit is about two things. Number one, um, you know, there's a back wage issue. There's a agreement between the employer and the employee. And I think everybody in this country can understand that when you're an employee and you have an agreement with an employer, you expect that agreement to be honored. And in this case, it wasn't. So that's, that's a major part of the lawsuit. But the most important part of the lawsuit is we're still in a situation where no one yet, and I, and I think it's important that people separate Penn State the institution from the people that were in leadership positions in November of 2011 and the continuing sit, uh, decisions they've made. And this is, you know, this is one of those things where they have yet to explain why we took a, a football program and people that were involved in that football program that were held up as a model yeah. for the rest of the country. I mean, keep in mind, a year earlier, Mark Emmert had Joe Paterno at the NCAA convention and gave him the Gerald R. Ford Award and said, this is the model of what a college football coach should be like. And there is no evidence whatsoever that has been presented that it was anything other than that. So I think there's, there's still some, some avenues that have to be pursued to explain why was that done, why were those decisions made, because it, it, to this day it hasn't been. So it's a combination of we still want the explanation of why decisions were made, and there are still some employer-employee issues that were not that have not been honored. Okay. And I think that's that's why we're pursuing it. 